Hey guys, welcome back to more Hogwarts Legacy. Do I have the mirrors turned down? I might have the mirrors turned way down. Mirror quality. I guess it doesn't really matter. Um, I guess I'm not, I don't really care. It's just a mirror. Um, I did just start at the game. So I do apologize if things are a little laggy. Are there only four of us? Maisie. I'm also currently puppy sitting. Um, and she can be a bit of a stinker. So I apologize if I start talking to somebody else. That would be her. Her name is, again is Maisie. So I'm going up. Oh. A ghost. Hello. Um. Yeah. That's just brilliant, Ami. Oh. Right, brilliant. You think you could? Ah, that is not how that. Do what? Why do I have three different objectives? Introduce yourself to a meat. Introduce yourself to Everett and to Samantha. Okay. I'm not sure this is the right spot. Well, this must be Samantha. Oh, yummy, yummy. I ate that apple in two bites. I want him to be in the perfect place. A place he'll be happy with. But I can't seem to find it. Great golden gobstones! I want him to thrive here. Golden gobstones. <laughs> My own little expression. I bought this Dittany seedling from home and I so want him to feel cozy. Dittany is amazing, isn't it? So much healing power in such a little plant. <laughs> I've a bit of a thing for plants, as you can see. <laughs> Pleased to meet you. I'm Samantha. Nice to meet you, Samantha. Oh, I'm Georgia Moosley. It is. Looks like someone's been studying up on their potion making. Actually, Professor Fig told me about Wiganwild Potion. Of course. I heard you were studying with him before term. He's an enigma, Fig. Teaches about theory. It seems to know a lot about practical magic. He's quite knowledgeable. I wouldn't really know. We'll go with quite Professor knowledgeable. Professor Fig does know a great deal about uh, different forms of magic. Well, I hope he told you about more than Wiganwild. You've lots to catch up on, I'm sure. Um, do most students grow Is their own ingredients? It's a practice for students to grow their own ingredients. Oh, yes. In fact, our herbology teacher, Professor Garlic, encourages Garlic. It. And I don't think <laughs> Professor Sharp, our potions master, cares where you get your ingredients, as long as your brews are all perfect. This, okay, I guess we'll ask about Hufflepuff. An Hufflepuffs. affinity for herbology is more typical of a Hufflepuff than a Ravenclaw, isn't it? Ordinarily, perhaps, but it runs in my family. We've a full plot of these little fellows back home. I suppose you could say herbology is in my roots. Ha 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 ha. It was nice to meet you, Samantha. Good luck with your Dittany. Thank you. And good luck to you too on your first day. Dittany. That's fun to say. Dittany. I miss having my own bedroom. One of the girls in our room recites potion recipes when I sleep. Another sings. Another mumbles incantations. All I can say is it's a part. Oh. I don't trust any of the boys. You find one venomous tentacular on your pillow and you don't soon forget. All I have at home are brothers. I could be sharing a room with girls with this tongue. Clearly, I was wrong. Thank goodness for the Garen charm. Okay. So I don't, this is either a meat or Everett. It's a meat. Hey, hello. Why, hello. Would you like to take a look? I love the books that just reposition Can't themselves. Can't see too much in the day. Well, except for stars like Sirius, Canopus, Vega, and Arcturus. I'm Amit. Pleasure to have you in Ravenclaw. Never met someone who's been so close to a dragon before. Can't say I recommend it, frankly. It's nice to meet you, Amit. I take it you like astronomy. Oh, yes. So much to be learned from the stars. Also, 
There's something about the open air and night sky above the tower. It's invigorating. You will adore astronomy. Professor Shaw is incredibly knowledgeable. Um, I find the stars. I have astronomy on my schedule. It's schedule. I have good news schedule. For you. you are most definitely taking astronomy. It is required for all fifth years. You will be enthralled with the tower. Plus, a quality telescope can show you things you never dreamed of. I suppose I'll see you in class then. Why is yes. our face highlighted oh, so speaking much? Speaking of class, better get to my first one of the year. Nothing like the smell of fresh parchment, is there? Be seeing you. Okay, bye. Are you? Are you? Oh, he is leaving for class. I was wondering if it was going to be one of those things where he's like, "I have to go," but then he doesn't actually go anywhere. Oh, they're all leaving. Well, I guess not right all of them. Moment. Hello, Everett. One moment. Watch this. Oh. Ugh. What is this? Someone threw a dumb box. <laughs> Let's get out of here. That wasn't okay. quite the reaction I wanted. Oh well. What did you hope would happen? I suppose I hoped it would lighten the mood. Ravenclaws can be a bit on edge the first day of class. I'm Everett, by the way. You seem downright calm next to some of these characters. And you survived a rather harrowing trip here. I'm looking forward to my first day. I'm actually a tad nervous. We're gonna go tad nervous. Harrowing indeed. I'm still a bit on edge myself. And a little nervous for classes to start. Oh, you needn't be worried. Is he supposed to be Truly, like no a knockoff Harry nervous. Potter? Most professors are firm, but fair. <clears throat> I mean, not all of the tricks I play are as simple as a tossed dung bomb, and I'm still here. Wait, did you say most professors are firm, but fair? Ha, <laughs> I did. But probably best I let you judge for yourself. I do tend to push their limits. <laughs> I should wander off before someone traces that dung bomb back to me. Nice meeting you. You too, Everett. Okay. Hey there, new Ravenclaw. Professor Weasley is looking for you just outside. You had best not keep her waiting. Who's talking? I was like, why are you following me? What? What is? Oh. I thought it was pointing at the statue. House chest. I don't have anything to put in the house chest, I don't think. Is that like a save point? <laughs> if I come up to that, it saves? I think, I feel like I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I am going the wrong way, I'm confused. Ugh, we're spinning everywhere. I do have to go to the statue, don't I? The statue's gonna take me down. Oh no, there's stairs over here. Never mind. <laughs> it's not the statue. Oh, hello. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, True. in light of your unique situation, Joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extremely extraordinary to ensure your success oh yeah i'm sure the headmaster had a bunch to do with it here you are my own little cheat sheet whoa what is it it <laughs> is a wizard's field guide it will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. Hi. 
you would be wise to take full advantage of this I don't need you on my lap valuable resource Maisie <laughs> I don't need you up on my lap thank you professor but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have walk with me and we shall put it to the test all right I'm after you this way mm-hmm the guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law it almost sounded like she said wizard wizarding lore I wasn't paying attention to the subtitles I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student Why don't you cast Revelio on this bust and see what details the field guide can provide? Ooh, which one's Re <laughs> this one? Revelio. Yeah, there you go. A field guide page. Ravenclaw bust. This bust created in honor of Ravenclaw House resides in the lofty Ravenclaw Tower. You've just unlocked a field guide challenge. Your progress towards completing challenges appears here. Field guide challenges are the only way to acquire experience points or XP. I'm pressing that button. <laughs> and it is not opening anything. This is your wizarding level XP earned from challenges increases your earn XP earned from challenges increases your level of power. Buckbeak! I forgot there's hippogriffs. Right? That's what they're called? Oh. Buckbeak is my favorite, like, animal kind of, like, animal type creature in the Harry Potter series. I love Buckbeak. <clears throat> your field guide tracks your current challenge progress. It's like the challenges menu to continue. Collecting your first guide page unlocked a new challenge category. New challenges unlock... The new challenges you unlock throughout your adventure will appear here. Each challenge has tiers. Special rewards unlock at each tier you complete, from appearances to critical upgrades. I get spectacles. Oh boy. <laughs> rewards must be claimed from the challenges menu. Come, come back often to collect rewards you've unlocked. I'm sorry, I'm trying not to yawn. I woke up like... 40 minutes ago. Oh, I'm still kind of waking up. Okay. Um clever, isn't it? Keep your eyes open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle. Okay. No time to waste. You've classes to attend. I'm not wasting time. I'm right here. What is this? Oh. Okay, so these are all different kinds of spells I can learn. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, I have seen things with this puzzle. Like, I've seen clips of people solving it. I don't remember how they solved it, but I've seen clips of people solving it. Oh. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. You can open the map at any time to fast travel to any discovered flu flames. Hogwarts is divided into two main areas. The left side of the map is where the students and professors live and includes the house, common rooms, and the great hall. Where am I going? It's like the grand staircase region. What is 
This is the grand. Okay, this is the grand staircase region. In this view, you can see the flu flames available in that region. Green flu flames represent flames you have discovered, including your own house common room. Gray flu flames reveal the location of undiscovered flames. Okay, I apparently missed the one in the dorm. The right side of the map is where you'll find academic points of interest, including the astronomy tower, libra library, and greenhouses. Okay. Professor Weasley has unlocked the central hall flu flames for you. Use right control. That's what I feel like that means. Oh yeah, to rotate the map and fast travel to the central hall flu flames. Green with the X. Okay. Uh, I think it's a little hints. Target lock is an effective tool against an enemy. You want to combo and now it's gone. A uh, white outline indicates your active target. Aim mode, left trigger reveals additional secondary targets and a ret reticle. Reticle. <laughs> I will say the loading screens are actually like for me probably the like one of the laggiest points in the game. I don't know how common that is, but for me, the game really struggles with the loading points. Y will protect you from incoming blockable attacks, and holding Y will follow up with Stupefy and try not to yawn again. Um, a counterattack that temporarily stuns certain opponents and breaks shield charms, except on hard. Oh, I'm not playing on hard, so. No. Oh, I keep thinking I have everything picked up off the floor for her, like, that she could chew on. And then she comes walking around my bed with something else that she shouldn't have, so. <laughs> Typical puppy. She's um, a mini Bernadoodle, so she's supposed to be, like, you know, Bernie's Mountain Dog and Poodle. But the thing is, like, she, so Bernie's dogs aren't mini, and I'm she's a Merle. Quite the time saver. These but, stairs know. lead directly to Central Hall. Ooh, and we struggle coming out of loading screens. Okay. Aren't I supposed to come out you of like a chimney? Quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Ah. Help, I'm frozen. Help. Oh, I was trying to take me into a cutscene, that's that why. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both charms and defense against the dark art. And I'd like to be oh. sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Okay. What's Hogsmeade? You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all wizarding village in Britain. And is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. I have tried butterbeer and I thought it was disgusting. <laughs> I hated it so much. I was not a fan. Okay, um, can you tell me more about what charms? Learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Can you tell me more? Oh, where'd my sound go? Defense, defense against, against the dark oh. arts, as the name implies, oh. focuses on how to defend oneself against You're on the evil. struggle bus today. A defense against the dark arts is required for those who aspire to become auras. Isn't that what Harry becomes? We are lucky right? to have the ever gifted Professor Hackett in charge of our students' education in that regard. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, 
I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. Oh, I want to tell her because I like her so much. She's so nice, but I'm not supposed to say anything. I'm just going to... We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... Mm, I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well... He's going to do his best as I can to randomize. For keeping the details to himself for now. Speaking Speak of... Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today, and remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. Okay. Um, I don't know if you could tell i also one of the things that i also turned down to not be at such high quality is like non-important npcs so everybody looks a little neutral faced there is a reason for that i did turn that setting down um i'm trying to like i was i would rather have the environment look like as it was intended than a bunch of random people so um if I have to sacrifice rando NPCs or the environment, I'm sacrificing the NPCs. <laughs> it's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? I hope I didn't say too much. She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, <laughs> why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. <laughs> nope. <laughs> we are struggling today. Nope, that didn't do that didn't nope. That was nope. I don't know why we're struggling so much today. It doesn't I don't think it makes much sense, but I guess we are, so Okay. The yellow thingy represents main quests. Completing main quests will further the story, unlock new features, and grant XP. 
Some quests are locked by spell and or level requirements. In these cases, you'll need to be the required level and or have the required spell to activate the quest. New spells can be earned by completing professor's assignments or as quest rewards. I do love a good side quest. <laughs> Track a quest with A to continue. So there's charms class. Or there's dark arts. I really want to do dark arts. But I also am the kind of person to save the best, like, what I feel is the best for last. So we'll go to Charms. Oh, Untrack. The map what? is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead. What with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman. God, how old is friend. Mr. Ollivander? I shall reach out when I have more information hey, oh, about oh, 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 her hold on, mysterious hold on. locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Apparently we're pulling things off of shelves now. And I didn't want to cut off Fig, so that is why I did not cut. <laughs> okay. Ooh, what are these little thingies? This cannot possibly be as difficult as it seems. Hello. I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. I'm Lenora. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. Everyone thinks I'm utterly balmy. What does that Samantha mean? Samantha thinks I'm potty. What does but that mean? this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Have you learned anything about it? Are there other paintings? Are there other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. Have you gained any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. Okay, let's if have I a look have at time, it. I may look. Could be intriguing. I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better luck than I have. Okay, so Lumos is... Do come and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves the mystery. Nope, that's not it. That's not it either. What is it? <laughs> Tago. Nope. Nope. Which, how do I... How do... <laughs> How do I cast Lumos? Oh, I don't remember. No, oh, I don't want settings. I'm so sorry. I'm confused. Where do I find my... I don't remember what the button was. Nope. You are already at your... I know. I, I, I know. Like a moth to a frame. Lenora mentioned that the painting reveals a clue when she casts Lumos. I don't remember how to cast Lumos. Oh, hold on. I'm getting a phone call. Sorry. Um. I still have no idea. This. 
This is what I was looking for. Do I know how to... I could have sworn I knew how to cast Lumos. Don't I? I was. I don't remember how to do it though. Lumos. There we go. That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Hey, would you stop? You're being really annoying. <laughs> okay, I forgot it was like a combination of buttons. This looks like the location from the painting. What could be so special about it? I think there was Statue of Gregory the Smarmy. The statue is with an ingratiating grin depicts the medieval wizard Gregory the Smarmy, the wizard famous for inventing Gregory's unctuous unction, a potion that makes the drinker believe whoever gave them the potion is their best friend. Okay. What do I do about this moth? The painting revealed an image, right? Ravenia. Hey! She keeps pulling like these old stuffed animals of mine off a shelf. I'm really tired of it. Okay. Rebellion. Get down. Get down, Maisie. Come on. I can't do anything with it. I have searched the hall, it's right there. I don't know what you want me to do about it. Can I... It's not really doing much. I see it, I know it's, I know what it is, I know. I got there we go I don't know what to do with it <laughs> not a clue there's also some blue flames what is that is it just a flying book or can I do something with it? I think it's just a flying book Oh, wait, 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 wait. Lumos. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. That's what I, okay. They're moths, they're drawn to light. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Ha. Where is she? It says she's right around here. Nope, not this way. Oh, she's up here. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I followed the clues. I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it you have a knack for solving riddles natty's good at that too so is a meat although he does tend to over explain <laughs> well i'm glad someone figured it out okay now i'm going to class what is this 
Oh, another one of these. Okay. Um. Well, that has to do with that. Okay. I have a potion idea that I don't write down. Oh, I guess I can't go that way. Yeah, I need, no, I need, I want charms. I need to go this way, but it's not, oh, there it goes. Okay, whoo! Hundred and forty two staircases. Can't imagine having hundred and forty two staircases. I don't feel like anyone should be out of shape if you attend Hogwarts because of the amount of stairs that you have to climb on like a daily basis. What do you want? What can I do? This Fluffy, I'm trying to go to charms class. I don't think this is it. No, I need to go up. <laughs> don't mind me. Here we go. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Oh. A quest? My class is a quest? Behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well... It seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. I really like this professor too. Set your wand with L and guide it along the symbol's path to learn the spell. Akio. Akio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember. Potential is nothing I like practice. this professor as well. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. I also Back love like all the representations well, of like to have the people from different cultures. It's an exceptionally lovely day. I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion 
outside for a spot of fresh air. Also, I'm the only one who did anything. After me. No one else did anything. Which is unfair. Oh, I do not like the loading screens. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst. <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> So why don't we have why a am I the only one up oh. hmm? <laughs> My feet are going through the floor. Friendly chirping. <laughs> so why am I the only one that's up there with him? Everybody else is... I am such a main character. <laughs> this is my story and everyone else is just playing in it. Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. The trick is to pull the sphere as far as possible, but not a bit more, or it'll fall, yes? Oh. Now, I could keep talking about theory all day, but practice is the best professor. Show us how it's done. No, I don't like that it's lagging as soon as I try to do something with it. <laughs> That's it. Okay. Splendid. Ha 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 ha. Hush. Very good. Points to Ravenclaw. But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. Come on up. <laughs> What'd she say her You'll name was? Blues, just Na before. Natty, Onai, right? You are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Oh, it's okay. <gasps> Roll off! Roll no! Oh, I wanted to, I wanted to roll off. Nope! 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 <laughs> To the best of us. Gosh, dang it! Not if, if she knocks one of her balls off, does it count? Whew. Okay, I need to get both of these to be fifties. <laughs> well, I guess I could. Not exactly your typical lesson, is it? Not that I mind. I'm sure you don't, because you're totally winning at the moment. Okay. There's 150. No, she's still gonna win. I can't get... I need... I would need... 60 more points. Which isn't an option. Stop! Well done. Dang it, I still lost. Rematch! I the challenge you to a rematch or not. Oh. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Oh. <laughs> no. I think we are well past interesting at this point. <laughs> I'll say. Okay. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. 
If I say B sharp, will like it help me too? There we go. Okay. Ooh. Excellent control there. Let us do this. Bonk. Whew. Okay, let's do this one. Woo, 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 woo. Okay. <laughs> Say slow down, slow down. Quite impressive. I don't need a comment after every time, Natty. Here we go. <laughs> yes. Um. <laughs> I know everyone is watching, but try not to okay. be nervous. Okay, please stop talking. Nope, 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 ah, 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 she still won. She still won. Are you serious? Dang it. See, I'm too competitive Very for good, stuff like both that. Of you. Well done. Now, rematch. Challenge you to a rematch. Actually, okay, I'll let class finish, but then I'm gonna end the part. So, the way out. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It transferred. I promise. Are there other wizarding schools? Um, I'm glad you understand. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Oh, she before grew up with I magic. It, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. <laughs> is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me this enormous school. So there is another that wizarding to be school. Floating in midair. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu. But I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. How? Until next time. How do you know? Of course, you can <gasps> use a word if you would, mm -hmm. if you're so inclined. You wanted to speak oh, to Sebastian. me, Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation. Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? Miss Onai is a talented witch, 
Take it in stride. One often gains the most from the battles one has lost. Of course, Professor. It was a challenging match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Alrighty. So now I just have um, dark arts class to do. So we'll do that in the next part because I'm going to end this part here. So thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, there's a blue flame in here somewhere. It looks like. I'm not seeing it. Why am I sprinting? Um, I mean, I suppose we could talk to a few of these After students. After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Akio this, Akio that, cutlery flying everywhere. Quite unsafe, really. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom, but a bit mad. <laughs> Okay, anyways, yeah. I'm ending the part here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, so my Sims channel and my Twitter are both linked down in the description below. If you'd like to check either of those things out, I would greatly appreciate it. And yeah, thank you guys, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye, guys.